Take two. Take two. Take two. We were not live. We thought we were. Here we are. We're here. You guys, go outside. I'm going to replay this. <laughs> Everybody, get off the couch. Get out of bed. Grab a chair or bench. Grab your weights. Grab some water. Come outside. Because it's beautiful. All right. Nice and easy. All right. We were doing heel taps with a big pull out. So I want to welcome my Aqua Motion Remains and my pink room in place peeps. We're super glad to have you here. Nice big giant reaches. Open up that chest. Squeeze your upper back. So today is our resistance day. I challenge you to resist me. All right, let's tap it out to the side. Nice big arms. Want to get those heart rates up just a little bit? Get those joints loosened up before we grab our weights. And today you can go a little bit heavier. Challenge yourself or go a little bit slower with those weights. And then if you get tired, you could have a lighter set too. So you could grab those lighter ones if you wanted to. Let's reach a little bit higher. Open up those shoulders. Let's do four more. So my name is Linda Harding Hicks. This is Carleen Sawyer offering you your chair option. We do all this with pink room in place. Big circle, big circle. Super big, super big. Ooh, challenging your brain here, right? Yep. <laughs> Feel free to sing. Woo, one more time each side. Move in those shoulders, tap back, reach those arms forward. So I hope you guys have some fun plans this weekend. I would not go to the mountains. They've had a lot of snow. You will need uh, chains, which is aren't no fun to put on. I remember if you do go up, watch signs. Do not park on people's property. Don't leave trash. I hear a lot of people complaining about that up there. All right, three more. Two more. One more time. And let's pull that knee up. Knee up. Woo. Big reach. This is my assistant here. This is Vanilla. She's like, what are you? like, what? Good. Woo. All right, one leg. In and out. How about out and in? <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, I'm going to tell you I'm a little ditzy. So my husband had his surgery yesterday. It went fantastic. He's doing well. Um, he was up at 3.30 this morning um, making phone calls and doing emails. Uh, he was in surgery about seven and a half hours. So he did really good. One more. All right, now you gotta do the other side. Here we go. Out and in. So I sat and watched Naked and Afraid for about 12 hours. So we dropped him off at COH at 5.30 in the morning, <laughs> we came home, ate breakfast, and then we just sat and waited for phone calls all day. So, long day, so now I'm kind of like, Woo! but I did sleep well last night, so I'm super ready to torture you. So we're all good. All right, two more big ones. All right, one more time. All right, now we're gonna do a straight leg rainbow. Ready, up and over. Up and over. Now, if you can't go that high, it's all right. Just go low. So I'm still working my hip, right? I'm just not going as big, and that's okay. If you can, make it bigger. If you need to, hold a wall, hold a chair, or just put your leg against something so that you feel more balanced. All right, you ready? Switch legs. Way over. I gotta scoot over this way. Try not to block Carlene. Oh, I got a dog in the way. <laughs> Go over the dog. Over the dog. Oh, she'll just be part of it. <laughs> Our assistant. All right. Let's do one more time. Woo! All right. Let's grab our weights. I got one right here. Oh, you got your weights. Can I just good, use good. You can use her. <laughs> All right. Let's start in a lunge position. I'm going to put one foot back. Let's 
do a big row. So in this one, if you want to just hold one heavy weight or put both weights in one hand, if you have light weights, this is a row. So remember, I'm looking for that grasshopper elbow. Get that elbow up. Hand on that thigh. Get that little extra back support. Make sure your tummies are nice and tight. Pull. And pull. Make sure your neck is long. Shoulders down. Pull it up. All right, now one back, one side. Here's one back and one side. One back and side. Make it pretty. Pull. And back. Pull. Nice. Now make sure you have your chair or your bench ready because our break is going to be on that chair. So if you are a chair person, I recommend you try it. Or you can do it standing and just do knee lifts. I'm going to show you in just a second. You got one more on this side. All right, now set that weight down. Hands on your device, whatever that device is. That's real. It did? Well, oh, here we go. Knee in. So, option one. You can do this standing, right? I'll do that option one. Option two. Higher incline. See how she's up higher? It's a higher chair. All right. Option three, a little lower. You're really advanced. You can do this on the floor. So these are called mountain climbers. And I'm doing them a little bit slower. Four more. Three. Two. Now I just want you to hold it right here for just a second. Just hold it because you love it. All right, bring it in. Grab that weight. Other side, big lunge. Big lunge, pull it back. So looking at that grasshopper elbow. Pull it up there. Pull, hand on that thigh for added support. Pull, pull. Now make sure you have some good breathing. So when you pull up, I want you to exhale, ready? Exhale. Remember, breathing, it helps calm you, helps it be more rhythmic, helps you really fill up the body with oxygen. Keep going, keep going. But he'll have to wait. Love him dearly. He forgot. He forgot. He always forgets I teach right now. All right, now one back, one side. One back, one side. One back. Come on, pull, and pull, double up, nice. Yeah, so hopefully my husband's calling to say he's up walking, because they're supposed to walk him three times today, so he was really excited about that. Two more, come on. I hear grunting behind me, one more. Woo, it's everybody's weak arm. All right, here we go, back to your spot. Back to your spot. All right, so green. Oh no, I love it. Awesome, okay, so option one. What's option one? Stand up tall, do an ellipse, okay? Option two, on the chair, hold on. Option three, a little lower. Option four, um, on the ground. So, this time, knee goes wide. So let me show you here, knee is wide. So here's option one. Here's option two. Here's option three. Number four is on the floor. Pull. Woo! So these are planks, guys. Remember, if it hurts, you can go on your elbows. If it hurts your wrists. Also, you can walk your hands out farther this way, and that'll open up that wrist. Instead of having them right here, with that hard wrist, walk them forward, and that opens it up, all right? All right, let's do four more. Two more. One more time. All right, grab those weights. Let's grab them both this time. Let's stand with a nice wide stance. Chair people sit, hands up on those shoulders, and we're gonna push one at a time. One, 
down. One. One. Pull. Squeeze in those shoulders. Woo! Nice. Come on, press. 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 Let's do four more. It's four. Three. Two. One more time. Elbows in. Push back. Push back. Squeeze in those triceps. So, when we did those plank movements, the mountain climbers, and our spider plank, you were using your chest, your tricep, as well as your core muscles. Core is anything between your shoulders and your hips. Right? So, you were using them all. Come on. Press it back. Woo! Okay, so funny story. I was listening to my daughter yesterday while she was on at Polly for her classes. And she had a substitute. And I was cracking up because she sounded like a flight attendant. All right, ladies and gentlemen, grab your cameras, turn to this channel. And um, anyways, I thought that was kind of funny. So hopefully I don't sound like a flight attendant. Let's do four more. But did I distract you long enough to do a few extras? Two more. One more time. Set one weight down. One weight down. Circle back, circle down, circle back, circle down. It is raining. I hope you guys are under a cover. And press. Woo! Let's do two more. You got this? Woo! One more time. Woo! Switch sides. Ready? Here we go. Pull up. Pull in. Now remember, any of these hurt? No, no. You can always switch to a bicep or a tricep. Listen to your body. Woo! So you can see Carling struggling on this side. A lot of people, your weak side, a little bit harder. One more. Sounds like hail. It is. Woo! Fun. All right. Hold your weight with two hands. Two hands. Lift it to the front. <laughs> it's loud. Can you hear that, guys? Woo! Lift it up to the front. All right, hold that tummy tight. We're going down slow. Up, down, down, down. Lift it up, down. Oh my God, this is so fun. Woo! Oh my God. This is so cool. We're in Southern California, you guys. It's hailing. So cool. Two more. One more time. All right, grab that weight. Take it all the way up over your head. Now drop that hat. Wait, without hitting your head. Push it up. So take it down to, up to. Now let's try to point that elbow straight up to the sky. Lay your ear and uh, bicep really close to each other. The weight's too heavy. Grab one of your lighter ones. Woo! That hurts your shoulder. Do the kickback one. Two more times. Oh my God. One more time. Woo! This is so cool. Switch sides. All the way up. Ready? Here we go. Down. So cool. Wow. Okay, I have actually swam in the snow. One time at RCC, it snowed. Woo! They're so cool looking. Oh my gosh, it's like a huge. You guys, look how big these are. This is awesome. Two more. All right, cheer people can set those weights down. Everybody else, hold it in front of you. Down and up. Wow. Oh my God, this is so fun. I know, it's hard to focus. So keep moving, keep squatting. You can look out the window. Check out that cool hail. 
set them down. One last set of planks, you're done, I swear. All right, ready? So let's get in that plank position. Holding. All right, squeeze your butt. Squeeze your tummy. Keep them tight. Here we go. Spider. Pull. And pull. So you're lifting your knee, trying to aim it towards your wrist. Tummy stays tight. Booty tight. Four more. Three. Stop any time. Two more. Woo, more time. Ow. All right, bring it in, shake it out. Well done. Well done. All right, let's put a foot out there. Let's stick that butt out and stretch out the back of this front leg. Now, you still need to do cardio, guys. You haven't done cardio yet. So, you need to go to YouTube. Look for Aqua Motion Ability Foundation. You're gonna go down the file, either go to Pink Ribbon or go to Cardio. You're gonna pick one of those out and you're gonna do it. It's a nice 30 minutes. So you get a one hour, well-rounded workout today. Switch legs. Otherwise, you can go for a walk in the rain. That's always fun. Ooh. I need attention, mama. All right, let's take that foot and push it back so you're gonna lunge, just like when we did the row, but now we're not rowing. So press down. Now take your hips and push them forward so you feel that stretch in the front of this back leg, right here. Ah, now if you need to hold something, that's all right. Doesn't matter. As long as you feel that stretch. Very nice. Let's switch sides. Other leg back. So get in your lunge position first, then press that hip forward. So if you're in a chair, make sure you're holding the back of the chair or the table so that you're supported and safe. Remember, these workouts are designed for my seniors and disabled people. Hopefully they can all do one of the things I just showed you. So you have lots of choices, there's no excuse, you guys. No excuse not to move. My husband had major surgery yesterday. They're gonna get him up and walk today. You guys did not have major surgery, right? So you can get up and walk no matter what. All right, bring it in, take a nice deep breath in. Blow it out. He's actually part of a study showing how exercise helps recovery. So, you guys, super important. You guys are way above that, right? Pull behind, because you've been with me all year long. You guys, on the 16th, we are doing a drawing. 100 episodes, and we are at one year, right? On the 16th, we hit our one year mark. And you guys have stuck around this whole time. Hopefully not sick of us yet. All right, push forward. You have so many choices. But remember, ours, we're free. We've been free all year. And Pink Ribbon has supported us, collaborated with us to provide this program just for you. Pull back. Now, if you've been cleaning, because it's raining, what else can you do? Go home and clean. Um, then call them and set up an appointment, reach up, and give your stuff to them for their store. They should be opening pretty soon. So clean it out, get rid of it. Carlene just did her garage, you should see it, it's beautiful. Other side, big reach up. Because when we get back to our real world and get busy again, you want to be super organized, super ready for whatever it is we're going to end up doing, hopefully at the pool. All right, bring it in, roll that head. So you want all your towels together, you want your noodles together, you want your little swim jacket, you want your hats, your swim shoes, your fins. All right, look up and down and say, yes, Linda. That is exactly what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go organize my garage. <laughs> Two more. You guys, thank you so much for coming. We do love you dearly. One more deep breath in. Blow it out, give yourself a great big hug. Pat yourself on the back. Say, I am a rock star. And give me a high five. Woo, we'll see ya on Tuesday. Love you.